fun-loving and economical subcompacts are a very hot class of automobile in these days of higher gasoline prices, cutting-edge technology, and value for the dollar. Mazda has lots of experience building fuel-efficient, sporty, and price-friendly models, and the 2013 Mazda 2 hatchback is a real player in that category. Right up front, let's admit that the Mazda 2 doesn't set any new standards for exterior style. Its short wheelbase, raked front end, and short rear deck make it pretty much resemble many of its competitors. The Mazda 2 is not a road rocket, lacks many of the techno features you'll find in its competitors, and has a pretty mundane cabin. But the Mazda 2 makes up for those shortcomings in other ways. The interior of the Mazda 2 is not lavish or luxurious, but its simplicity and utility make for a comfortable environment. The front seats are just right for most adults, but taller drivers may wish for a telescopic steering column, and there's no escaping that the rear seat is on the cramped side. But its circular style dash and control layout are simple and straightforward, with its orange colored instrument lighting making it easy to read in daylight and soothing on the eyes at night. Now Mazda's technology menu is very limited on the Mazda 2. There's an auxiliary audio input jack, USB port and a CD player, not a changer, but no nav system, backup camera, or footwell lighting. The Mazda 2 is offered in two trim levels, Sport and Touring. Both are fitted with the same 1.5 liter, 100 horsepower inline four. A five-speed manual or four-speed automatic transmission sends power to the front wheels. Problem is, there's just not a whole lot of it. We prefer the five-speed manual that gives the Mazda 2 an almost Miata driving experience. The automatic is adequate, but doesn't add any real punch to the proceedings. Here is where the Mazda 2 shines. It still manages to deliver that elusive fun to drive factor in spite of its lukewarm specs. The steering is razor sharp and the engine's lack of strength is offset by its willingness. And that five speed is a perfect match for those hundred horses. Mileage, a respectable 29 city, 35 highway with the manual gearbox. Powertrain warranty, five years, 60,000 miles. How about $14,720 for the base sport model? Spend slightly more at $16,210 for the touring trim, and you are styling with 15-inch alloy wheels, cruise control, and a six-speaker stereo. Comparisons to the Honda Fit, Nissan Versa, and Kia Rio will show the Mazda 2 is also just a bit cooler and sportier. After pointing out all of the Mazda 2's weaknesses in the sporty subcompact segment, we still have to admit we're fans of this little hatchback. Price is hard to beat, the fuel economy is better than average, and the Mazda 2 will dart through traffic like a mini athlete.